and we're back to learning GIMP and this time I'm going to show you a quick and easy mosaic effect. You can apply it to any photo, I've got the original right here and I copy it, let me rename it. Make sure that you've got your layer selected that you want to apply the effect to, so in this case the mosaic layer. You can go to filters, distorts and there you'll find the mosaic filter, click on it, this menu should open. And the effect is directly applied because I've got the preview checked. As always, you can directly blend this effect with the original, so the layer below, which is basically the same as the opacity right here and the blending modes. We don't need it for this effect. For now, the tiles are very small, but they're hexagons. You can change it right here via the drop down. Let me increase the tile size, and you can see these hexagons clearly. You can also adjust the height. If for some reason it doesn't load, just uncheck and check the preview again. So in my case, I've used a very big photo that takes a little bit of processing time. You can adjust the neatness so it becomes more chaotic if you go down and more orderly if you go up with this value. And there's also color variation. You can see that the tiles have different colors. So if you go down, that gets decreased. If you go up, you get more of these random colors. The checkboxes here, they only have a minor effect, so don't worry too much about them. The tile spacing, this is another effect that has a huge impact. It's basically the stroke of these tiles, and you can also adjust the color of it. So by default, they're black. Just click on it. Here's, for example, the color wheel, make it red. Let me go down with the spacing to decrease the stroke and then I click on OK. It's going to take a little bit of time to get processed. But here's the effect. So this was the original and with the filter applied it looks like this. So this is an easy way to create this mosaic effect in GIMP. If there are further questions let me know in the comments below. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.